The old house, which was an addition to the mobile home, had a shingled roof that had caved in. It would not have been smart to film while demoing this, as the house area was a claustrophobic terror dome with nails poking out from everywhere. I entered with the utmost of caution, removed nails, stripped shingles, and pulled down one rafter at a time, mostly by hand twisting them. The roof of the mobile home, on the other hand, was made of a tough rubberized tin. Since I was demolishing the home without a bulldozer or other heavy machinery, I determined that the best way to remove the roof was to get up on top and cut swaths of it using a reciprocating saw. You can see I'm on the roof of the mobile home, about to cut the roof off in U-shaped sections. To do this, make sure you have good hearing protection and some really rigid robust I repeated the same process, starting from the far edge and progressing back to where my ladder was, cutting one U-shaped section at a time. Once the tin roof was down, it was fairly easy to remove the mobile home rafters and walls. 
As the end of summer neared, it was time to demo the floorboards of the mobile home and finally the metal frame.